All right, we are here with Rivals 100 linebacker Justin Hilliard, uh, just committed to Ohio State. Justin, um, you know, I'm sure you've been asked this question a million times already today, but you know, what was it for you about Ohio State? Uh, really, what it was about Ohio State, I believe, was the people. Uh, the people of Ohio are great people. When I went up there to visit, we didn't talk any. For my last visit, we didn't, we didn't talk anything about numbers or football. I just hung out with the players, hung out with some of the coaches. And that, was, that was really the turning edge because uh, that's, what, that's the place where I want to be for the next four years, and I feel like most comfortable at Ohio State. But I'll talk about your relationship with Raquan McMillan. There's been a lot made of that. You know, how much of that is just you know a nice story, and how much of that is actually legitimately you know you guys have really clicked as, as friends. Yeah, when I went up there, they called they called me Lil Lil or like they called him Big Hill or something like that. But uh, yeah, yeah um, we have, we have a really good relationship. We're actually we're actually texting actually before this. I told him this one. Day, but, uh, I would say he's one of my one of my better friends. And, and and Sam Hubbard as well, I think played a role in this. I mean, how long have you known Sam just from you know being GCL guys? Yeah, I've known him since freshman year. Um, we've been we've been we've been friends, but I would say through the recruiting process and hanging out with him at Ohio State, uh, we've really built our relationship. And uh, you know, we talked about this a little bit today as well. But you know, who are you going after now on the recruiting trail? I mean, you've made it a point that you're going to be a recruiter now. Yeah, the um, the, the big guys were definitely Josh Sweat, Damian Harris, Matt Burrell. We have a we have a whole list of people we're trying to go after. It's a, it's, a, it's a small class, but hopefully we can get to top three, top top one, I guess. Um, you know, how do you attack these guys? I mean, obviously, there's there's a difference between a recruiting pitch that maybe isn't genuine and you know, legitimately, you know, trying to get these guys with, with honesty and kind of yeah, telling yeah. them the truth about certain things. I mean, where, where do you you know how, how do you attack that? I guess you, gotta, you know, you got to be versatile. You know, for a big boy like Morell, you got to say the food's great up at Ohio State or at Ohio State or whatever. But actually, I would try, I would probably say the people. Like I said, I, that was probably the turn edge for me. I believe if we can get them on campus just one time and hang out with the guys, not talk too much about numbers, but really hang out with the people, that will be an easy choice. Right. Um, you know, talk about just uh, that that last breakfast you had uh, with, with Coach Meyer. Um, you know, before you really made your decision. I mean. Obviously, you may not want to share everything that was that was um, said at that meal or whatever. But you know, what were some of the things of, that you guys discussed at that point? Yeah, it, it was a, it was a great um, breakfast we had. Before that, I actually had a uh, breakfast with the dean of the business school, which was actually uh, was really cool too. Coach Meyer was there, but um, really what we talked about was kind of you know the home state thing. He, he really wanted to tell me for us like go with your heart, even if it's not a hostile state, always support you, which was really meant a lot, really meant a lot to me. Right. His last question here. I mean, you're heading off to the opening here. Um, you know, what are your goals there, both maybe on the field and recruiting-wise? Uh, you yeah. know, what are you hoping to do up there? Uh, yeah, me and Jason, are, we're actually going shopping today. We're well, not together, but we're going to get all, you know, all, all our Ohio State gear. So hopefully, we're rocking and everything up there. But uh, I would say, from uh, I would say, I know my times are getting a lot better. So hopefully, I can get compete for the what do they call it, the, the top, the top, uh, the top leader in the Spark Challenge. But um, also, also to win the Silver Challenge. All right, it's Justin Hilliard, uh, newest Ohio State commit.